What's up, guys? This is Chris. I'm the Cyber Guy. I'm many things. You've probably seen me on this channel for gaming, but probably you've seen me for, hopefully, you've seen me some of my ethical hacking stuff. Uh, you know that I work as an IT instructor, an IT contractor, consultant, subject matter expert, whatever you want to call it. I'm the guy for, I'm the guy behind the guy. So I thought I'd take a moment today to make a quick video about Kali Linux. Kali Linux 2023.1 is just out. It is um, actually not like any other Kali Linux we've had in a while. There's uh, there's updates <clears throat> to the new Kali Linux, but there's also something called Kali Linux Purple. What is that? Well, some of you have heard of like Red Team, you've heard of Blue Team, but you may not have heard of Purple Team. Purple Team basically means that you have um, the Red and the Blue Team working together. So it's like the new hotness. Purple team is the new way to go. Um, you know, it doesn't mean that the, the other teams are going away. It just means that basically you're going to have purple team discussions. And now we have in our favorite ethical hacking penetration testing distribution, there is a purple team version. So let's go ahead and get into it. So we're going to look at the uh, Cali Linux 2023.1 webpage. Today we're releasing 2023.1. I'm a couple weeks behind because, like I say, I've been working. Um, but 10th anniversary, uh, it's ready for immediate download. Kali Linux Purple. You click on Kali Purple, this is what you get. Over the years, we perfected. We have specialized in offensive security. We're now starting to branch into a new area, defensive security. Initial technical preview launch of Kali Purple. So it's still in its infancy, so there's still lots of bugs. Uh, I'm going to be doing some testing myself with it. I already have it actually downloaded. I can show you real quick what it looks like. Let me go ahead and log in to it. There is Kali Linux Purple in all its glory. It is purple. It has, looks just like regular Kali, minus a few adjustments. I'm running it in VirtualBox. If you've not uh, seen this before, you can check out some of my other videos on how to run VirtualBox, how to set up virtual machines. But ultimately, here we go. So we can go to uh, the Kali menu, and you'll see that all the tools for ethical hacking, blue team, red team, they're all still there. Um, but there's a whole another section here called... Uh, identify, protect, detect, respond, and discover. This is tied into the NIST um, cybersecurity framework. So if you're not familiar with NIST cybersecurity framework, it is a framework for, you know, basically best practices for cybersecurity and defense. So identify, we've got uh, Cisco, uh, we've got Multigo in there, we've got open source reconnaissance framework, we've got Spiderfoot, WPD, uh, Z Attack Proxy, all the usual tools. Under protect, we've got Clam Antivirus, uh, crypt setup, firewall builder. It's so minimal security uh, required for Kali because it doesn't have a lot of tools, a lot of open services running all the time. Uh, detect. So we got Grok EVT, which I'm not familiar with. I'm assuming this has to do with parsing logs. And so I will be digging into some of these tools a little bit later. Respond. You've got the NSA's, of course, Ghidra tool there. Great. Um, what else we've got? Sleuth kit. Uh, Net Sniff, Ollie Debugger, Wireshark, of course, the venerable packet capturing software. Wireshark is uh, where it's at. One of the first tools I recommend people learn if they're new to cyber, or they're new to blue team, um, red team, whatever. Um, recover. So we've got uh, recovery tools, so forensics tools. So then you still have all the regular information gathering, vulnerability analysis. You've got Linus in there, which I love. I love Linus. It's a great tool. Um, not to be confused with Linus Tech Tips, who I also love. Great show. Web application analysis, database assessment, password attack. So there's all kinds of tools in here for the potential red team, blue team to figure out where your um, uh, vulnerabilities are at. So you've got, besides password attacks, you've got reverse engineering. You've got Ghidra again. You've got Jadex, which is a Java decompiler, GUI, um, Raid Array, popular uh, reverse engineering tool. Exploitation tools. We got search exploit, sniffing and spoofing. You got the usual sniffers, net step, sniff, Wireshark, TCP replay, and then you've got post exploitation tools. Do they still have meta exploit in here? I don't know. Let's see, meta exploit. But again, it's still Linux, so you can install other tools on here if there's a tool that you want. It's not like you can't install other things. So first thing I'm going to do is go ahead and take a snapshot. Make sure that I have a good backup. So if anything gets corrupted, I'll be good to go. 
So let's open up a terminal. Let's type some commands. So terminal, there's your shell. So again, I like dark mode. So again, if you want to customize your terminal, you can. Um, there's some nifty new wallpaper. And they've got in the desktop settings, they've got some cool ones like this. I really like this one. I'm using this on my other Cali distribution. Um, but then they've got, maybe you like blue. Or a blue patterned uh, kind of jungle mask looking thing. And you got the traditional... Cali Linux, the quieter you become, the more you're able to hear. But I'm going to rock the purple for a while. I guess there's like two. Is that two tones of purple? Or is it different? I can't really tell any difference. So right now it's zoomed. Maybe you want it tiled, scaled, stretched. So you can pick it however you want, however you want your wallpaper to look. So let's go ahead and do who am I? Yeah. Let's see. Let's go ahead and ping google.com. So depending on your network, this may or may not work. Ping. Uh, let's see. I have config. So we're, yeah, we're in, that's right. We're in a virtualized network. So I have to switch the uh, virtual box over to bridge mode. And purple. So I have several virtual machines running here. Uh, network bridge mode. Boom. There we go. Now we should be good to go. Do IPAS. Ethernet zero. And there we go. Now we're on a regular network, so we can ping the router. Cool. Do sudo apt get install metasploit. And tab completion is your friend. Metasploit framework. So if you want that, you can go ahead and install that. So pretty cool. Looks nice. Looks real clean. I'll do a further in-depth review a little bit later. But this is just to kind of get your feet wet with Cali Linux Purple. I didn't know about it until I saw it on a video on YouTube. Uh, John Hammond did one. So shout out to him for uh, paving the way for the rest of us people that are still kind of new to streaming for cyber. But... Uh, if you want to see me do more videos like this, let me know. I'm going to keep this one fairly short. So I want to say uh, thank you very much for uh, watching my channel. I appreciate it. Um, I do try and earn the subscription. I'm not out here asking for views or likes. It is Friday, so on Friday I take a moment to pay homage to those that are still deployed. I know we're not in Iraq and Afghanistan anymore technically, but we still have people that are serving. So uh, thank you to all those that, are, that have served and are still serving. So... Uh, appreciate you guys. So we'll do more um, with Cali Linux Purple a little bit later. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.